Let's do this damn thing. Let's hike out of here. Oh shit. Almost busted my ass. Damn. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. Almost busted my grill. Can't feel my fingertips. I'm gonna take a nice hot shower when I get home. Having mudslides and shit. Well, kind of like yellow birch. I think that's what it's called. I think that's yellow birch. You guys tell me. It's definitely flammable though. I've used it before, it's all wet now. But, it works good. It's weird because on the other side, there's like maybe one or two or not that many. Right over here, like a whole heap of them. All right. Yeah, see? The road's kind of mud sliding out. A little scary, for sure. There's like two people who live on this mountain. 
so that'd be crappy for them. Well, that was nice. Nice little hang out in the woods. Get soaked. Yeah, so about that bought in bug out bag. You guys won't believe me. I lost it. I don't know where it is. I don't know if I left it on the on Death Mountain or what. I can't remember. It's pissing me off. I was looking for it because I was going to do a video on it today. About why you shouldn't buy it. And just make your own. But uh, that's not happening at the moment. Went to go buy a new one. Another one. And uh, they don't have them anymore. So, no go on that one. But, let's see what we can do. Sorry about that. Can't believe that happened to me. But, actually, yeah, I can. I left the axe on this mountain. <laughs> so, I definitely can see that. Huh? Not much I can do now. I don't know if you guys can see the rain. Probably not, but man, it's it's pissing. <laughs> yeah, so pretty sure you guys aren't gonna like these. Knife reviews I got coming out. <laughs> They're a quick, down and dirty type of deal, man. Straight up. I was really surprised about the Kershaw one, man. I wasn't. At, uh, I just wasn't expecting that for fourteen dollars. I think that's pretty dang good. Fourteen bucks, man. That's a pretty damn solid knife. It's a little, uh, not that smooth, but I'm pretty sure if you break it in, it should be good. I mean, I don't know. I won't be able to know until the long run, but it doesn't look like a bad blade to carry, so. I'm gonna carry it for a little while, see what it, see how it holds up, how the steel holds up. And the buck is like, a, eh. I really love the blade shape though. I mean, it's a nice folder. For the money though, I don't think. I think, to be honest, <laughs> the Kershaw is pretty much better built. Stronger, frame lock. than uh, the buck. So, I don't know how that happened. That's for damn sure. <laughs> but it happened. All on the fly too. 
they definitely weren't the best reviews, so, you know, sorry about that. Apologize for that in the beginning. So, uh, you know, nobody murders me about the poo, poo reviews. But at least I'm in the woods reviewing them, right? <laughs> it's got to count for something, right? I'm out here in the pouring rain for you guys out in the woods. And for myself, too, as well. Give you knife reviews. Hell yeah, Reaper. Thanks. Thanks, Reaper. You the man, man. You the man. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, okay. Man, I really hope I didn't do any damage to my camera. It's an expensive-ass camera. I'll tell you that right now. <laughs> so I hope it's okay. I don't want to bore you guys too much about the hike out. You know what's going on. Reaper Militia sidetracked outdoors. Gearaholic. Much respect, much appreciation, knowledge is power, practice is progress. Hell yeah, now get outside.